What's going on everybody? My name is Dwight Dillon and I help performers eliminate stage fright and performance anxiety. And today I wanted to answer a question that I received from a reader. We were going back and forth and after I asked her which one do you know the lyrics best, she was talking about a song she wanted to do for karaoke this weekend. She replied to me, and this is what I'm going to answer in this video, I get nervous and I have to look at the words on all of them, referring to the songs that she is trying to choose. Probably Cornet Man, one of her options, because I've been singing that since I was a kid, but I've only done that song once for karaoke. She continues, if I was doing a show, I'd rehearse the song and memorize it. Is that what I should do for karaoke? Yes. Okay, I'm so glad you mentioned that. Now, the great thing about getting prepared for karaoke is that you're not in your head, okay? When you go and sing karaoke, and for a lot of people, karaoke is a really kind of, it's a big deal, okay? So this is a great, appropriate question for, you know, getting used to being on stage and performing on a stage, even if, if it is a, t a tiny little stage at a, at a bar where you don't know anybody, okay? And you're looking at the words. That's still, it freaks out some people. So the best thing to do is, let's say if you're going to go sing karaoke this weekend, go and take 30 minutes each day and memorize, work on memorizing those songs. I do the same thing, okay? I love to go to karaoke and sing r and rap. You don't really sing rap, but rap. And I spend a lot of time preparing, like at least 30 minutes every day up to that point because when I get up there and I'm and I have the words memorized and I'm rapping and I'm doing my own thing, I have so much more fun because the words are just coming out of my mouth and I can focus more on my enjoyment. I can focus more on you know pointing at somebody in the, in the crowd. I can walk around with a mic. I can focus more on what my body is doing and just enjoying myself and letting go. And the words just come out of my mouth. And you know, for people for um for this reader, okay, in case you do end up forgetting one of the words. You have the words right there as a buffer to help you out. So you only have to look at the words when you need to, and that's a great thing. Also, if you're looking at the words and you have them memorized, that'll just simply drive it home even more for you, okay? So yes, one of the most important tools, uh, more like one of the most important abilities to really harness when you're a stage performer, any kind of stage, okay? field, if you're an athlete, if you're a comedian, if you're a dancer, whatever it is, if you're a musician or singer, is make sure that you've got your material down, okay? That way you're not in your head and you can truly enjoy yourself. And I explain this in one of my products, okay? So, before you go to karaoke, whoever's listening to this, make sure you've got the words memorized at least 95% so they just flow, all right? Now, if you, would enjoy, if you have enjoyed this information in this video, and you want more things like this, more videos like this, and more content, go ahead and sign up for my email list. The link is below. That'll take you to a website where you put in your name and your email address, and you will join, you will be subscribed to my daily newsletter where you'll receive daily tips and a bunch of other great information on how to eliminate stage fright and performance anxiety in all areas of life, okay? And you'll also join Team Dylan, and while you're going through that process, you will as well receive, um, receive some videos that will teach you. Um, one of the things that I teach is my go-to phrase for just taking away um, anxiety that is caused, you know, that starts growing in your stomach, as well as you will receive my annihilate anxiety technique that I use all the time. All right, so once again, if you've liked this, go ahead and click the link below, and that'll take you to a website where you put in your name and email address, and you join Team Dylan Newsletter. All right. I will talk to you later.